In this video, we bring you a 70-30 e-liquid from Seriously Donuts. Oh yeah. Alex, what have you got here? Well, Pete, <clears throat> I've got an amazing dessert-based <laughs> 100 mil short fill range. It is Seriously Donuts. Apple fritter. Mate. Right. So every single one of these, I vaped a lot. It's phenomenal. Right. So we've got apple fritter donut. Then you've got glazed biscoff. Right. So let me tell you a story about the glazed bis biscoff. I like a bit of biscoff. Me and my boss are both like, that's amazing. I had some uh, Nick Salt nicotine. Yeah. I turned, we both got 50 mil of 20 milligram Nick Salt made out of that. Oh, it smells it's good. so good. Wow. You, I love those Biscoff biscuits. You know that you're getting a proper cup of coffee when they drop a little cheeky Biscoff by the side of it. That is spot on. Alex, I cut your story short, but... Originally glazed? Originally glazed. Then we have raspberry jam... Classic donut. Yeah. I don't like the classic donut. But Strawberry and cream. It's amazing. How have they done that cream? And lemon drizzle. That's a surpriser. The lemon drizzle is... So the ones I've put out... So I've nailed these. Yeah. The ones I've put out for us to try right now are the apple fritter because it's the one that leaps out from the page of... I wonder what that tastes like, as well as the glazed bis biscoff. But I'm saving that for me, so I don't want to let you have any... And the lemon drizzle donut. Because lemon drizzle donut, you're like, that's... Is that going to be really good? It's Is a it? bit like the apple fritter. I want a little bit from, of zest. If you're yeah, going to yeah, give from, me lemon drizzle, I want zest. That's Alex. it. So either end of the scale of how I've set them up, you've yeah. got, right, classic, more classic -y sort of donut, you know, let's say new wave donuts. Let's say, you know, when it, when we think of donuts, we think of the, the well-established one that you find in most uh, city centres. Yeah. It's quite expensive. Yeah. And it begins with a K. Yeah. And the second word is a K. Although they're both incorrectly spelt. spelt you know, I, should be I a don't C. think we can say it without getting in trouble. So uh, No, I'm not going to say it. Okay. Cool. They should be spelt with C's. Yeah. Yeah. But anyway, I thought lemon drizzle, donut, apple fritter donut, let's give them a go. So yeah. I've got the lemon drizzle in this PMP X tank from Vupu. Great tank. Great it is a great tank. Flavor tank. Right, so I've got it set at 70 watts. Are you ready? Okay. Blow my mind, Alex. I want to see clouds for days. Clouds, bro, clouds. Oh, yeah. Every single thing you want from a lemon drizzle donut is in here. Every single thing. You get like the zestiness say, of the lemon. You get the, the you get that donut flavour, that that thick dough sort of flavour. Yeah. And you get just sugar. You get that sense of sugar. It is absolutely stunning. Okay, you've and teased. it's not a coil killer. So far. Oh, wow. It smells so strong. I mean, not only when you blew it across the room, does now the room smell just like donuts. It's but so good. Oh, mouth's watering. Alex. Wow. Okay, that's a little bit. With a microphone that close, nobody wants to hear you salivate. Yeah, they don't want to hear you go. So, yeah, sorry about that. Um, Especially to people that can't see us, because that makes it even worse. Just the whole listening experience. I mean, we could pretend bit, it's a tap in the background. It's a bit ASMR, isn't it? Yeah, but um, not good ASMR. Gee. Bless me. Oh, that's, a, that's a good way of blowing um, your eyes out of your head, holding your nose when you sneeze. I was, I was trying to do it quietly. Um, so, Alex, for anyone that's watching that's going, wow, 100 mil short fills. What's all this about? I've just started vaping. Can, mm -hmm. can I have that? Is that going to be like my disposable? Uh, well, no. So, short fills generally are going to have a thicker VG ratio than something you'd start commonly with. So, short fills... A zero nicotine. That's why you can have a bigger bottle. You can't have a bottle above 10 milliliters if it's got nicotine in it. So you would add nicotine yourself to these, but with the space you've got on top of the the e-liquid that's in there that's a zero, you're realistically only going to be able to make a three, yeah. which is what you want when you're sub ohm vaping, which is when you develop a load of flavor, you blow out a lot of clouds, 
you have a below one ohm resistance coil, that means you're sub ohm vaping. In this case, that's a 0.15 sub ohm coil, PMP coil, with the lemon drizzle, and it is phenomenal as a sub ohm bit of kit. So these, this isn't what I'd ever recommend anybody to start with. This is when you know that vaping is something that you want to do. You don't necessarily need nicotine anymore, but you want all of the flavour all day long. This is where you want to go. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of truth to the the kind of stages of vaping being like just listen to the person serving you. Mm-hmm. If you're in a vape store, if you've just started um, an interest in vaping. Listen to what other people are saying. Yeah, yeah. Jumping straight into something like this means you're going to have to have a very low level of nicotine. Mm-hmm. You're getting a huge amount of vapor production. So yes. your, your actual intake is going to be greater yeah. in volume than what you'll get from a small disposable or a small mouth to lung pot. That's very true. So where you might be having um, a, a 20 or a 2% of nicotine, um, when you get to this amount of volume of, of vapor production dropping it right down to a three is actually you're still getting as much as what you need. Yeah, yeah. But you may not be able to cope until um, you've given up smoking for a while. You may not be able to cope with this style of vaping. It doesn't suit for everyone. No. They, they want to stick to mouth to lung, similar to a cigarette, get rid of that addiction to the cigarettes, drop your nicotine down. That's a perfect time. Um, 70, 30 and 50, 50. I prefer a 70, 30. Yeah. It's um, less catchy for me. I find it very, very smooth. Um, but you can still add a Nick salt for the, to the short fill. You can. So you, you can have a three milligram Nick salt based short fill e-liquid there. Yeah. Um, I, think, I think it's a great way to go if you're looking at a developing flavour. You want to enjoy blowing out a load of clouds, being a bit antisocial. But at the same time, enjoying what you're doing without necessarily needing a lot a high dose of nicotine to do that and i think a 70 percent vg yeah it's really smooth on the throat it's um you know it's going to give you maximum clouds you know because a higher vg ratio means that the way that the in, the e-liquid interacts with the the coil the wicker material the, the the vaping process means that you produce far more vapor yeah um not necessarily the best thing to start with that that's basically it. A fifty fifty nick salt potentially, or a fifty fifty free base nicotine e liquid. They're probably far more what you need when you initially start. It's good having one of these in the background though, as your evening little. Bit what of fun. I really like is there's AIO devices now that you can take around with you that are more convenient than the bulky mods that will take a seventy thirty. Mm-hmm. So there's plenty of devices that will take this type of juice, and obviously it's a far more affordable way of. Of getting your juice as well um so it's something to bear in mind on your vape journey what i would say alex is wow i had a lot of lemon just then it was so good um uh, yeah it's, it was a little bit of a surprise just how much that makes you salivate though it really does so what have, you, what have you got loaded so, up in this tank this is the apple fritter donut as discussed earlier so this is in the free max fire Luke solo tank yeah this is all about high power high vapor production all flavor and the apple fritter is i'm i I don't use this phrase lightly about e-liquids this is a game changer wow big words oh i just miss the days of clouds bro clouds i sometimes do yeah. When you've got great e-liquid like that, yeah. It, for me, there's like a time of day where I can vape like this because it's so antisocial in as much as you don't want to do it in a small room. Don't do you it don't in your car. Go, you don't want to, yeah, you don't want to do it in your car, definitely not. You you don't want to do it at a bus stop no. <laughs> or a smoking shed uh, or shelter, whatever. But and we need to ask you to refrain from doing that because, you know, that's what gives vapors and vaping ba- a bad name is, is when somebody, you see like, a, you know, there'll be... A, people who aren't smokers or vapors waiting at a bus stop and then you just see this cloud this plume of vape and it, it's even though you know it's fine it's not going to do anything it's it's that perception and we want we want vaping to be legitimate we want vaping to be all the way yeah um the right thing to do to transition from smoking and 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 totally. you know let's 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 take every let's take other people who aren't smokers or vapors into consideration when we're doing what we're doing. You don't have to. I'm not going to harass you for that. 
How good is that, man? That's far sweeter than I anticipated. Mate, it's so good. I'm getting almost like a golden syrup amount of sweetness from this. The apple is so tasty. It's crisp. I try and blow it away from you because we will fog out the room. That is superb. And you've paired that with a brilliant tank as well. Oh, for sure, yeah. Um, Flavour-wise, they uh, they don't need any correcting on the name. They really are seriously donut. Yeah. They, they're... I'm going to say it, hand on table, hand on heart. They're just the best donut range I've had in a long time. Oh, so know? good. That Biscoff is in, insane. Next time I'm down, Pete, I'll bring you some of my uh, Nick Salt version of it, just so you can have a little tank full. In a 10? No, I've made it in a 20. I didn't make it for you. I'm giving you a little free sample. Well, why would you give me the wrong oh, one? Oh, shut up. Right, anyway... Uh, seriously, donuts needs to be a Nick Salt range as well because the flavours are incredible. Do, do an appeal now. Maybe they're watching. Probably not. Right. So, seriously, donut. Uh, wait, wait. Dear seriously, donut. This is an appeal from the FV Vape Show. Please give everybody the opportunity to sample your amazing flavour profiles. How about? making a 50-50 Nick Salt Range version of them. Everybody would be happy then. Everybody would. Please. For just £4 a month. Oh, sorry, that's a different advert. Oh, no, no, no. Sorry. You went yeah. off track at the yeah, end. But sorry, that's okay. Guys. That's yeah. okay. It's easy to happen. It's, it's because, ultimately, from doing this, I'm hoping that I get a Sponsors. job as a voiceover. Oh, right. Voiceover Got artist. You. Yeah. Um, Alex, blown away. Have you ever hit an earring? By Seriously Donuts. Awesome, awesome, awesome range. range. Yes. Check them out. So we hope you've enjoyed this review of the Seriously Donuts range. We definitely and seriously enjoyed those donut e-liquids, didn't we, It's Pete? been a sweet treat. I feel like I've had too many calories, but, you know, my calorie count is still low. So. And you look like you've had too many calories. And until the next time, I've been me, you've been you, Pete's been Peter. Uh, well done for that.